The relic leopard frog is an animal that uh, biologists thought was extinct, so back in uh, probably the late 50s. And it wasn't until uh, the early 1990s when scientists rediscovered the animal on some springs near Lake Mead. So this is a really, uh, really sensitive species. And because it's an unusual species for us, we've paid our usual extra special attention to the construction of its habitat. This is the Springs Reserve's first uh, semi-aquatic uh, exhibit. So most, uh, pretty much all the other uh, animal exhibits here, since they're all based off of Mojave Desert animals, um, they're all strict, uh, just terrariums, right? So with the frogs, we've got that water element added in. So we've got artificial pond that's part of the, uh, part of the exhibit, and then other high basking points and, uh, and soil areas as well. So the animals can be in the water or, or get out of the water and bask, but uh, it's a really great uh, viewing opportunity for guests to be able to see the relic leopard frog up close and personal which is why we were striving for the ideal conditions that would stimulate both the frogs and the people viewing them. We really want to have these as animal ambassadors, so you know, they're, uh, they're active as much as possible. Satisfying their varied appetites also took some study. So in the wild, they're going to they're gonna eat all sorts of you know, different invertebrates that uh, they can get a hold of, you know, whether it's uh, you know, maybe crickets or snails or... It, Anything, I mean, they're going to be pretty opportunistic. But now they seem just as eager to eat what we're serving when it's feeding time at the preserve. It's going to be lots of crickets and mealworms and maybe some other, uh, other types of uh, invertebrates that we might kind of uh, use as more of a treat-like food item from time to time. Anybody who takes the journey to observe this unique exhibit will find plenty of food for thought about how this little amphibian can adapt to the natural challenges of the desert. It you know, really fits into uh, the overall theme of the animal exhibits here at the Springs Preserve, which is, is really survival here in the Mojave Desert. And we hope the example of the relic leopard frog will cause people to ponder what has made it such a surprising survivor and how we all can contribute to the future success of the species. It's a really unique opportunity for the Springs Preserve um, to be able to help educate the general public about uh, this uh, animal and its biology and, uh, and hopefully really share that conservation message as well.